Welcome to Ladies and Gentlemen. So what I'd like to do is just kind of discuss with you a quick little video on the difference between complementary and supplementary angles. And basically the way that this works is if we have two angles that add up to 90 degrees, we say that they are complementary. And if we have two angles that add up to 90 degrees or 180 degrees, we say they are supplementary. So let's kind of go through a basic definite our basic kind of examples of, you know, an angle that is 180 degrees as well as an angle that is, you know, 90 degrees. And when using the degree um, kind of measurement system, we take a circle to have a degree measure of 360 degrees. Therefore, to rotate um, all the way around a circle would be 360 degrees. So half of that is going would be just like a straight line, right? So if you go all the way around as a 360, half of that is going to be 180. So therefore, the measurement from here to here um, is going to be 180 degrees. Okay? Um, now, <clears throat> Therefore, if I have an angle that I could break up, you know, now I could say, eh, let's kind of break this up into now two angles. Now I have this angle and this angle. Well, those two angles, since their sum of their measure adds up to 180, right? You combine these together, it goes up to 180. These two angles are supplementary. And we can give them, you know, angles. We could call them angle A and B. Or we could use points to represent them. So we could say, you know, angle A um, and angle B are supplementary. Or we could also use points to measure them. So I could say that angle, let's call this uh, um, x, y, z, w. So I could say angle x, y, z, and angle w, y, z are supplementary. Okay. Now, the other thing to also recognize as far as supplementary angles, they don't have to share an angle. They don't have to be what we um, call adjacent angles. They could literally just be the exact same angles, but kind of separated from one another. As long as we know that they measure. See, here we know that they add up to 180 because they're combined. They share this side. They make up 180. However, if I just had two angles you know, kind of randomly placed around, and, but we knew that their sum of their measure added up to 180. I could also say these two angles, let's call these you know, angles C and D. These two angles are also supplementary because we know that the sum of them is equal to 180 degrees. Now, the same thing kind of goes with complementary angles. So here's our straight angle. So if we have a 360, cut that in half, we get 180. Cut that in half again, and we get complementary angles. And what's really important about complementary angles, especially when you're looking at a linear pair, we represent comp or an angle that has equal 90 degrees with this box. Um, the box just says, hey, that is equal to 90 degrees. Well, in this figure, since we have one that's 90 degrees, we know that this, these two angles, whatever we want to call them, are supplementary. So if this is 90 degrees, that means we know this is 90 degrees. So if I was going to kind of create an angle, you know, another angle here, and let's call these angle E and F. We could say angle E and angle F are complementary because I know that their sum is equal to 90 degrees. And why? Because I know that over here, that box represents 90 degrees. So if this is 90 degrees, that means that has to be 90 degrees. And therefore, the sum of these two angles also has to be 90 degrees. However, again, we don't need to have angles that are exactly perfect. They don't have to be adjacent, meaning share the same side. So as long as I have an angle that's like, let's say, 60 degrees, and let's say you know, I have this one over here that looks like 30 degrees, and let's call these you know, angle G and H. Well, as long as G and H add up to 90 degrees, we can say that they are complementary. So I'm not going to write it out. I'll just save some time. But just a reminder, supplementary angles are two angles that add up to 180, and complementary angles are two angles that are going to add up to 90 degrees. Thanks.